Oh, I'm sorry. Hello, YouTubers. Uh, welcome back to Kick-Ass Adventures. I just want to say I appreciate you guys watching my videos and uh, subscribing. I only got a couple of subscribers, but hey, you got to start somewhere. I promise you the videos and everything else is going to come out better. You know, I'm just starting this channel off, so it's still young and I got time to make it grow and make it better. Just, you know what, just, you know, hang in there with me and uh, I promise I'll make them better. I'm going to probably in three months, two months, I'm going to start traveling like down south, Tampa, St. Petersburg, Citrus County, Wikiwachi, Orlando, and some uh, North Georgia. Right now, I'm in South Georgia. I really don't want to tell you the location, location, because I don't know if I'm trespassing or not. Uh, I think this is county property, but you know how they are. They don't want people walking across their stuff. Right now, I'm going to try to make it all across here to get up that big old thing. So, if I bust my ass, you know, I apologize because you're going swimming. Oh, yeah, first step, slimy rock. I'm glad I wore my shorts today. <laughs> I bet you we can find some stuff in here. They got old pottery. I don't know if it's, you know, back in the cowboy days. Like right here. I don't know if you guys can see it or not. Like a tip of an old mason. Yeah, look at that. See that? Old mason jar. That's old moonshine and stuff right there. Throw that back there. I know somebody likes to drink out of mason jars. <laughs> All right, my feet are nice and soggy. <clears throat> yeah. All right, we made it up. Look at that. Those big old pots right there go to the uh the water plant. Actually, excuse my French. It's called I call it shit plant because it's recycled water. Then they put it back in your faucet and you drink it. But I promise you guys, this you know, hang out with me. I know this is a new beginning for me. It's a new channel, and uh, I know I can make it better. And I'm sorry about the last couple of videos I made. I know some areas was too dark but I got a new uh, light system I got on my tripod I call it a tripod all it is is a selfie stick with a whole bunch of lights attached to it so but just hang in there with me I promise I'll make them better and I'm going to different locations and it's not going to be all about you know spooky areas or abandoned it's going to be about a little bit of everything you know, like going through the woods, going down creeks, just to see what I can find. And just hope you guys enjoy, you know, nature. And I encourage everybody, you know, go out there, grab a camera, and just get away from the Xbox, you know, for a couple of hours. You know, Xbox ain't that important to waste your life away on. Look at those pipes though, boy. I tell you what, just imagine what goes through that joker. Ain't really too much to see right here. We gotta follow these pipelines down. I'm sure a couple of my other videos, I think uh, these same pipelines I got caught. Uh, uh, we're going down the same path. This is the same way it heads to that train off of uh, one of my videos. It's only like a minute, it's something wrong. I think that was one of the first videos I put out on my, first, my uh, new YouTube channel.
I'm trying not to give you guys wood blasts. That's another thing I'm trying to practice on. I went to YouTube the other day and I watched one of my videos. I almost got my own self dizzy off of the video I put out there. So I apologize for that too. But they are going to get better. So smell crap going through that one you smell it I'm glad you guys can't smell through television or computer it stinks like crap <laughs> Well, since I'm walking, I'll tell you a little bit more about myself. My name's Lamont Mellon. I'm starting this channel out because I want people to enjoy the nature and have a venture too. It ain't all about, actually it ain't all about none. I just want for the people, it's not able to go, you know, if it's medical reasons or just anything, they're not uh, able to enjoy nature like I am. You know, I want them to be able to go to kick ass adventures and say you know what i want it just like they're with part of the video i, I mean it's just i don't know how else to explain it you know it's, it's just beautiful out here sometimes early morning or late night you can catch a deer run by and i like spooky stuff too so if you guys give me i say probably a hundred thumbs up likes me and a buddy of mine found a, a haunted graveyard i know what you guys say oh it's a graveyard that's why it's haunted no this is like back in the 1800s i think the earliest grave was like uh that was born in 1832 and they died 1904 or something like that and the only reason i'm calling it haunted because i took pictures and i looked up my pictures and i blew it up and there's something standing off in the distance like the only pure white thing i seen was it i couldn't say it was a ghost or not it could be somebody walking by or but it made me interested enough to go back there and if you guys give me a thumbs up like or something like that i'll do it at night time and you you know just it'd be pretty cool you know you guys get to watch me run around screaming like a little girl because anything moves or jiggles or does the wrong thing i'm gonna be taking off like a set of rims at a puff daddy concert so i'm gonna haul at haul butt excuse my french all right we're going halfway well we made a pretty good distance this pipes are way down there sorry for giving you guys whiplash i know In all fairness with me, I do kind of feel kind of, you know, I'm not used to talking to a camera yet. Knowing that, you know, there's going to be, you know, a lot of people looking at it. So I still got to get that, you know, how would you call it? Get used to it. You know, I got to make it my second nature, you know, just to be able to talk to you guys and make it cool as possible for you guys can keep on watching my videos. Look like somebody's been back here recently because... With all that rain and stuff like that last night, or the other day, there should have been leaps across these paths. Some more of the woods. Way back there's the uh, black cat uh, skitter, I call it. It's a skitter, it's on tracks. I guess when they was building that uh, railroad track or something like that, or they was repairing it, 
it caught on fire and they just left it back here. I mean, that thing's a couple thousand dollar, you know, machine. And I'm surprised no, nobody came up back here and tried to drag it out yet. It'd be like a little pinhole. It ain't like a shotgun blast or nothing. It'd be like a little hole. Like a, uh, what do you call it? A little carpenter bees. It makes holes into a damn wood. Where does this trail go? Do you ever try to walk this trail straight back or? Because mm -hmm. it's the same way to the other side. Actually, you can go this way or that way. Oh. Because you know how we can go this way and then you cut through that one? Oh, yeah. This just cuts through this way and then that way we won't have to go through the woods right there. Oh. This is the same thing, so it just leads. This one leads to that uh, big hole right there. Look at that, man! Perfect. You can tell it was one hell of a, of a fire and melted the dang the inside. Yeah. The inside. Everything cut off on this side. The motor still looks, the battery. I was back here one day and the kids came and lit it on fire. The kids or something came back here. Yeah, anybody needs some scrap metal, just call me. I, I know where to get it. You just give me a, a finder's fee. I'll tell you where this junker's at. I'm just joking, people. I wouldn't because I ain't going to let you guys know. I don't want to get in trouble. Right now I'm rambling because I really don't have too much to say. I'm just... Kind of look like one of those scenes off a of fried green tomato. Waiting for somebody to come on a train throwing out canned goods for the people who can't afford food. Look at that little guy. Oh, where is he? You see him? He's a little baby frog. Mm -hmm. I probably stepped about 900 of the damn thing, darn things. Time to go full wheeling. I'm going to try to make this one long as possible. I'm sorry that I ain't really talking that much, but I'm just letting you guys enjoy the nature just like I am. I want you guys to feel like you, you're part of the walk too. So just, if you have to turn all the lights off, grab you some popcorn and soda pop and sit back and enjoy it. It smells like tar back here.
climb up this hill real quick. That'd be funny you guys catch me on video wiping out. Which way? Are you going to go this way or this way? I want to go this way, go straight out where that car is right there. I want to go check out that. Oh no, that'd be too much on the streets. Oh shit, I guess we gotta go this way then. You start leaving that thing at home, bring your damn knife. Unless I got my slot camera. <laughs> I hope you got something, because I don't got nothing except for a lighter and a pack of cigarettes. And I ain't gonna hang out long enough to give that joker a cigarette or anything. Sorry guys if I'm giving you whip blast. Man, you look past the cut. <laughs> Man, it grew up like wildfire. Yeah, somebody saw that that whole um, area used to be sunland, like full of houses and whatnot. Like, no, really? Sunland property, yeah. Like sunland was big. Like the process center used to be a sunland building. <laughs> yeah. Used to be a garage. <laughs> That big, man. I can't believe they go to business. Probably move to a new location or. I think they'll live where. the wind I know it's gonna be louder than what I hear especially blowing in that speaker right there I know it's a heck of a hike I like it though heck join nature so you guys out there I ain't saying don't don't stop watching the video, not now. When I'm done, go out there and hike a couple of your own trails. <laughs>